Love, light, and blessings. This is Germanic Agwag Priestess here, and I'm going to do a very quick haul video because I love my haul videos, but I always try to do my haul videos with a purpose, with a purpose. Some of the things I bought, I, I put away because I was like, eh, there's not really no purpose of showing <laughs> and things like that. And I'm going to use those items and something, so I kind of don't want to put them in the internet because like you know you never know who's watching so but anyway so i'm just going to share with you recently i got i think it's called the radiant wise ah oh my goodness the radiant wise tarot that um i got it from amazon i believe it was less than 16 dollars um yeah and it's going to be one of my working decks I think I'm going to be narrowing down my working decks from six to maybe three, almost four. Um, this is the backs, and this is the Radiant, and you can tell I've been using it because it's not in order, the Radiant Wise Tarot. Um, it's a Los Garibo clone, so it doesn't have the original Pamela Coleman Smith um, handwriting. It's, it's tight, but I love the coloring. The price is good. The car stock is good. It's glossy. And because when I do my readings, um, my readings are timed. Like I give you really quick answers. I give you the most for your session and things like that. Um, I started off in a psychic hotline, so I'm used to reading quickly, getting your answers out there. Um, decks tend to get really beat up. And um, so this is not going to bother me if this one does because I can easily uh, replace it. And things like that so and um and i just love the right away system i have another uh indie deck but it didn't cost me um a lot a lot but i'm gonna also incorporate that into one of my working decks um so i'm gonna be using that one um i'm gonna be having that one come hopefully soon but as you know when it's an independent and it's not part of prime it takes a while for you to actually get it so I'm just been like, they gave me like an estimate date. So I'm like, Bleh. <laughs> you know, um, I also bought this beautiful uh, tarot box and it did fit my tarot deck because I was worried about it. Um, it's beautiful. This was $15. It's solid wood. And I wanted to keep my working deck in here versus a pouch. So that way, if my kids ever uh, spill something or not that they really do that, but you never know, right? Um, I can protect my deck and kind of keep its energy because I usually used to keep it in a pouch, but that doesn't resonate with me. Like I want to keep it in a box. Uh, my mom always kept, the, remember my mom practiced cardamancy. She always kept her uh, deck of playing cards in some type of a box. So it kind of just reminds me of my mom. So I got that from Amazon. Um, I also went to the Spanish market the other day and I got two boxes. Um, so 15 candles. So I'm just going to show you one of each type of candle I got instead of showing you all 15 candles. Um, I got, um, I'm going to clean this up because they're messy, but I got this nice green candles that I'm going to be doing. Um, I've kind of went back to my roots. Um, I used to use the ones with the saints and stuff on them. My mom never did that. And I kind of been called to kind of like not so much use those anymore um my mom's like a, a witch always practices everything in secret don't let the person you're buying stuff from know who you work with so that's why i'm like i say certain spirits that allow me to say who they are there's a lot of spirits that don't want me to say who they are so a lot of voodoo a lot of santeria is very secretive uh even hoodoo and things like that so um i'm gonna be using this for a specific spirit but i don't have the the picture of it it's like a secret so anyways um, but yeah, I bought several green. I bought yellow um, for just different things I'm going to be doing. All these candles were $1.99 because my Dollar Tree does not carry color candles, only during holiday. So um, I have pinks and a bunch of other different colors, but I was running low on um, green, blue, and yellow. And um, then I got excited because these you can only get in the Botanica. I found the removable reversible double action candles they had double action triple action the plain reds the plain black four different colors of the removable and they were less than five dollars four dollars and sixty cents um i got this from c town or yeah c town 
um, which is a Spanish market. And then they also sell a lot of body clones. I was trying to get more like Florida water uh, soap, bar soap that I use, but I, they haven't had any like a month. People are starting to catch on. They even sell sulfur in that store. Like I get a lot of my herbs and things. Like I love that store, which helps me to save money, which helps me to uh, keep my spells where they could be affordable to more people, so on and so forth. So um, I got Colonia del Amor. So love cologne. I love working with spiritual colognes. I make my own, but I also like to buy. Um, and then Canela. So cinnamon. I have a bunch of these. If you guys want me to make a video, on the uses of spiritual cologne. I will be more than glad to do that. Um, and then I wanted to share one quick little witchy tip with you guys. So um, I've done hauls where I've showed um, the dollar candles that I buy that come in jars. So I reused them, see? Cause these were the two basil. I've used them already for what I bought them for. I bought them for as part of a spell that I was doing. And, um, they, I boiled them, I cleaned them, like they're good to go. Um, and so on and so forth. So I'm going to use these to store herbs. I also sometimes use these to, when I make my own candles, I have a container to keep them in. I mean, you could use them to hold your resins, so on, like there's so many purposes for that. So, but I'm going to reuse it because I'm going to put some herbs in there. Um, one of the herbs I'm going to put in there is I got from Amazon, Angelica Root. Um, I find it to be cheaper to buy these as teas because it's like the pure herb without the bags um, instead of buying the herbs from the Botanica because there's certain herbs I can't get in the Spanish market. So those I usually buy on Amazon. So I bought that on Amazon. Um, these candles I got from the Spanish market with this uh, spiritual cologne. I got those from the Spanish market. The tarot case holder, I got it from um I got it from Amazon and then I got these beautiful silk scarves from Amazon, which was cheaper for the price of one. I got four because I had bought it from the Botanica and they were like six dollars each. And this one I got for eight dollars, but I got four. Of them. So just for like two dollars more. So I got black. Um, these are like the satin, the satiny ones that people put on their heads and stuff. I wanted to use these as um altar cloths or big virtual we're doing this month big voodoo ritual we're doing um gray i got brown and i got red um because we're going to be doing a big big bet this month and i'm excited about it so um i wanted to you know you always bring your own stuff to a to a ritual it's a community relig uh, religious practice so everybody collaborates and cooperates and things like that so that is it so for those that um, want spiritual scarves you can get them on amazon um they got the satin one so just wanted to kind of give you tips on how to save money with your craft um and things like that or even someone who's not of that practice you can use them as altar cloths they're nice and silky and pretty and yeah so um they're good for head scarves too i tried them on and they're wonderful so all right guys so that will be it for this video much love light and blessings thank you so much for watching uh this video guys love and peace bye